In 2013, the UNICEF statistics shows that over 5.5 million girls were out of school in Nigeria. By 2023, UNICEF reported a disturbing increase to 7.5 million in Niger state. Only 40% of the total school enrollment is female, with even lower figures in rural areas. Early marriage remains a significant cause forcing many girls to drop out of school and off their future. A friend of mine, her name is Mariam, she got married at the age of 15 and had an edu and her education stopped at JSS2. So that is the problem we are facing. Our parents are giving off their children for marriage and their education stopped and nobody is there to take off their responsibility. In a bid to address this issue, the Ministry of Education in partnership with the wife of Niger State Governor Fatima Bako, visited the traditional rulers of the Beda Emirates to advocate for the education of the girl child. But we deem it fit to start with the Emirates. They will be our supporters in dropping this to the community before the sensitization commence in the entire state. Projects seek to empower girls by improving access to education and create a supportive learning environment for students like Maria Unkochi who are hopeful for a better future. I'm in need of scholarship. I don't think whether my father can take me to another school when I when I finish from SS3. I'm in need of help of governments to further our education. We have a lot of problems with the women and girls in rural areas who the educational um, program have been cut short due to lack of fund or probably some uh, autonomous beliefs which uh, we try to encourage our people that they must educate their girl's child. And fostering an uh, enabling environment for learners and equally it's enhanced, it is targeted towards providing financial incentive for girls. Early marriage continues to be a major hindrance to the girl child education in Nigeria. Community participation and advocacy is a sure way to combat this situation. For BTV News, Esoya Osemege reporting.